Right then, welcome back. Um, apologies, it's been a bit quiet on the old Gran Turismo and ride and everything else front. Uh, a few technical issues, and no internet connection. Somebody decided to dig a hole and chop through it. Very kind of them, uh, very kind indeed. So I was losing my mind trying to diagnose what was wrong. It turns out it wasn't my fault. Happy days. Anyway, uh, weekly challenges, February week one, race two, a special event, uh, Tesla Model 3, and we are at uh, Blue Moon Bay Speedway Infield. I quite like this track. Um, it's got a little bit, a little bit of everything. Fast straight, tight corners, hairpin, where if you're a bit of a, a handbrake monster, e-brake, as they get called in other various parts of the world, you can uh, do some big skids. Um, not a massive fan of the Tesla. Um, no, not for me. EVs, no. Just, just, just no. Just no. No, 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 and more no. Are we on the surface of Mars? Probably. Probably. Ooh, she's a big, fat, weighty girl. Oh, dear me. I mean, they're rapid. They are absolutely rapid. I get that. But the amount of energy <laughs> takes to stop one. Oh, I feel like a boat. An absolute massive boat. Little bit of off roading, thank you. Understeer, the understeer everywhere. Yeah, I just. I don't know, they're just a bit dull, aren't they? Or are they fast 0 to 60 and blah blah blah? And I wake up every day, I've got a full tank of electricity, I can go miles. Yeah, well done. Awesome job. I just. I don't know. I just don't. Just don't do it for me right now, I guess. Is that a... Is that a soft limiter at 156? It seemed to get there very quickly. Again. Maximum... Maximum torque and power from zero RPM. I have done due diligence on these things over the years, and I've read as much as I... Oh, the brakes. I've read as much as I possibly can about where they're getting the materials from, and how the systems work, the regen break-in, and I just, I don't know. I feel there's better ways to do it, but the companies are kind of holding them back and, like, dragging as much out of the consumer as they can before they give them something that will do 600 miles on a charge and will charge in 10 or 15 minutes rather than an hour. And the charging network in the UK, that is another absolute abomination of future-proof in the world or whatever. Decarbonising is the phrase that they want to use, don't they? We're going to decarbonise the UK transport network by digging loads of lithium out of the ground. Excellent job. Yeah, I just... I guess I'm just a bit sceptical. In fact, a bit sceptical is not the right word. Massively sceptical. And I am not, no, and by no means a flat earther or someone believes in massive conspiracies. I don't believe the government tells the truth. No one should. You should always question everything they tell you because they're only telling you to meet their own ambitions and objectives. It's got nothing to do with working for the people. Let's be absolutely 100% clear about that. But yeah, no, I'm not someone who believes that the world is run by lizards um, and the earth is flat with a local sun and a moon and... Although the groups on social media do provide me hours of mirth and entertainment with some of the suggestions that are floated about. And I, I have never seen the world from space. I am relying on information from other places. So if it turns out the world is flat, then I'm as guilty as everybody else. But yeah, no. EVs, mm, not quite yet. Not quite yet. I think we've got a little way to go. Oh dear me, 
it's the lack of noise and I know you can have the augmented noise in the cabin to make it sound like whatever you want the Renault's is it the Renault Zoe does that you can make it sound like a Clio V6 anyway I, they're just not for me yet and that race was dull incredibly dull right we'll call this one done then done and dusted race two we're on a tight budget aren't we now three days left so there might not there might not be any space for the old uh, online racing this week I might do some and just record it and have it in the bag 6.7 missed the mileage for two days as well which I'm massively annoyed about uh, but right I will leave you with the incredibly dull first lap of that race um, thanks for watching thanks for commenting liking sharing subscribing all the usual jazz and fingers crossed I'll see you tomorrow when we should be driving something much more noisy take care stay safe peace <laughs>